Greetings, my lady. Have you decided? I have. I stand by all I have said. I wish to endanger no one and thus choose the method involving an egg. If it's to be the egg of an Oriole, I know where to find one. There is a nest in my clearing. Might you explain the nature of the ritual? Its exact course? Sure. Want to tell you something, though. Think we should try the alternate method first. I was clear. It is out of the question. Let me finish. Second method's less than reliable. To put it simply, might work, might not. But it will. I shall save you, oh lovely Vivian. Why are you here, sir? This is a private conversation. He's not your foe. Got good intentions. You guessed right. He hired me. But only because he wanted to help you. Be not angry, my lady. You no longer bear this burden alone. I know all. You told him! I know a curse afflicts you. A curse which grows more severe by the day. I understand how you feel. My aunt, Countess de Lonfall, once contracted a strange illness which ate away at her from the inside. She grew weaker by the day, the light fading from her eyes. I remember her saying the worst was not the pain, but losing mastery of her own body. She was so helpless. I fear you feel the same. The Witcher knows a way to lift the curse from you and let it rest on me. I wish to do this, to take it from you, Vivian. Why? Because I love you. I might have died in the arena. I sought to slay a Shailmar for you. But now I see the fool I was. Now I see how I risked my life for no purpose. Yet with this, I can truly do something for you. I do not wish to inflict this horror on anyone. You saw how it looks, Witcher. I turn to you as one elder and hopefully one wiser as well. Do you think this a good idea? Worth a try, as I see it. Original curse fell on an unborn child. Doubt it'll take hold as strongly when transferred to a full-grown man. You've now heard the expert opinion. Let us do this together, Vivian. Very well. I was prepared to die. Thus, I am also prepared to attempt something mad. Now we must go to my pool in the woods, yes? Everything's agreed, so no point wasting any more time. Let's go. you mentioned what became of her she passed on die beast So, this is my true form. It is not too late. You may still change your mind. It will bring no shame. My mind is made up. My resolve is firm. If you can handle it, so will I. You are beautiful to me, even as you stand now.
Oh, that's clearly rubbish. Shut your eyes, both of you, and don't move. Kion? Yes, my love? If you become as I am now, I wish you to know I shall not leave you. Picture yourselves reflected in a pool of water. Focus on that. Now, open your eyes. Damn, I think it might have worked. Honestly, didn't think this would work. Doubted anything would happen. Read about this ritual in grimoires. Descriptions all seemed dramatic, embellished. All stipulated a condition that seemed improbable. What condition was this? A real bond between those involved. True love. How do you feel? In general, you feel it change, Guillaume? I was struck hard, as if by a battering ram, but... Now I, I feel not at all different, apart from a slight itch on my skin. Are you certain it worked? Yes, something happened, definitely. Must be an intersection beneath this pond. Powerful magic at work here. Look at Vivian. What now? Now? Now you get to live together, happily ever after. Still, watch yourselves carefully. Notice any troubling symptoms, find me. Naturally. I thank you, Garrett. Oh, and your payment. Oh, at last! I have so much to make up for. Balls to attend, distant lands to see. Free at last, as a bird! Ha! Huh? I find you droll. I had not noticed before. But you will not fly away without me. That remains to be seen, I think. But I too must thank you, Witcher. Don't mention it. You take care, both. <laughs>